Hello viewers, today we are going to learn how to manipulate or how to manipulate in Photoshop any version like 2016, 2015 and 2019. So let's begin our tutorial. This one is amazing tutorial for those who want to learn photo manipulation in Photoshop. So let's begin our tutorial. This is our image and we are going to take a document or new file then go to file and take new then select the page size make resolution 300 and press ok this is your document and now I'm going to my first image this one is my first and I'm going to make this one as a background so just drag and drop resize the image by holding shift and alt key then adjust it crop now again increase the size of this image make little one straight at straight line and increase little bit more increase little bit more then press ok now this is almost done my background image is set and now i'm going to place some extra image such like lamppost this is our lamppost image just select this one by using a rectangle marquee queue marquee tool then just drag and drop place it in perfect area this one is in perfect place make a little bit smaller now now i am going to place a model or uh, this is this is our model image i am already cut out this model by using pen tool then just drag and drop this model in that place make background little bit there and place this model between this so it's look great now hold all this one by using shift key and place it in perfect area now i am going to use a water effect in this image so what we have to done just we take this this image and I'm going to place this image in my main workplace so just place it sorry zoom out the image by using control minus just hold and hold shift and alt key and resize the image make little bit bigger your background image and drag this one here and this is the blank place there I, I place the water image apply this and take your model water image 
now i am going to remove all this outer side so take a mask layer go to brush tool and just simply make foreground color black and remove all this extra sides select pen tool and then select this model hand when you complete your selection then just right click and make selection feather edition 0 and press ok make this one copy and then paste or you can use shortcut key by using ctrl c plus v sorry here is the selection and press ctrl c and v c and v now your hand image is this type of your hand image now again visible your background image and then now going to max layer and take brush and remove these lines Take a time to make your work more better. Now adjust the opacity of your mask layer brush and then again apply this. Again decrease the size of your brush or opacity of brush and then use it. So I am going to hue saturation. Now we are take click on masking layer and now I am adjust the hue saturation. This is the saturation and increase the blue area. Take a time to make your work better. Now this one done and again go to your hue saturation layer, mask layer and make this one 100% and now we are going to remove the other side like this. Click on again this water layer and decrease it 8% and now using this one so now we are going to see that the background color and your water layer is almost match and now we are going to change the background of this one so what you have to do we take some fog image or foggy light image so we are select the fog image by using 
so now we are going to place a background image just drag and drop this image resize the image by holding shift and alt key by clicking right click and duplicate layer and just drag this area and use mask layer and brush tool and remove this one remove this line now it's look awesome then uh, merge this layer now use again mask clear and select brush tool and remove a little bit this right. the car image is not shown so just hide this layer and again go to paint tool select the car layer and select paint tool and just select the car image Make selection selection inverse and delete select deselect and also remove this area selection then go to select and deselect the layer and now remove these lines place this one behind your background and apply and use a mask layer on your background image so just clean this okay. just remove this one remove this one this one this one yeah now remove the complete area So your work is almost done and now we are going to adjust the color of our whole work. So go to color balance, click on fill adjustment and then go to color balance and adjust the color of your work. Okay. Now we are going to make a shadow of this lamp. So take a blank layer and under this layer just take a brush tool, make opacity 100% and take a black, just click this time and flat it. Make this circle in flat portion. Easy now. Increase this 
this one the woman and the lamp post shadow work with same line so now your work is almost done and mask the complete layer in one layer so just hold shift alt control and press e the whole layers are masked in in one layer make this one duplicate layer and then go to filter and select camera raw adjust the color of or saturation increase the saturation and exposure a little bit darker and highlighted area make little bit higher clarity increase the sharpness click on effects and decrease it little bit select the area of a highlighted area highlighted area make yellow and shadow area make blue press okay now again click on brush mask a uh, brush tool and make opacity 8% and select black and rub this area now press again hold shift control alt key and press e then make this one again duplicate and go to filter and select nick collection and go to color effects pro 4 before this i am going to add a body image so take this body image just press there now now i am going to or uh, first of all i am going to color this image by using image adjustment and color balance just as adjust the color now the color adjustment is completed now mask this complete layer by holding shift control alt and e and go to filter and make nick collection then color fx pro 4 now increase the shadow area and make this one this one is depend on you 34 then press okay Now again I am going to blank layer and go to adjustment layer and take gradient and this one go to natural density and press okay and select any of a uh, this one and press okay make radia inverse and increase the scale then press okay now again go to photo filter and make this photo filter warm filter 85 make percentage 20 so your work is done hope you like this tutorial if you like this tutorial please subscribe my channel see you soon with a new tutorial okay thank you and goodbye